ID, when you file out a petition, the accused and the accuser, the person that you're accusing and the person that is accusing the other person, they are given the opportunity to settle the case privately or use another alternative to resolute the dispute that they have rather than going to court. So when you put a petition down, sometimes courts will put very long process thinking that you will find the common ground to settle it outside the court. And if you don't find the common ground and if it persists, the petition will continue if you have your proofs and your evidence. So when was this petition that I filed against this cyber bula that has been terrorizing Edo cyberspace for the past seven years? When was this petition written that came from me and why and how was this written? This petition was written 2022 August 23rd. The evidence are here. I posted it on my wall. Listen, Ritotarians and everyone who care to know, you are the people I'm giving explanation because Atu Ari knows about it already. 23 August. 23 August. Not 2022. Okay, 2020. Yes. Two years Thank ago. You. Two years ago. 23 August 2020. Abi? Yeah. So if you see the date of the petition that I posted on my wall, it's not 21, it's 2020. 2020. Before I started this video this morning, please share the video, my people, if you are here with us. Share the video. Before I started doing this video this morning, before I came into this video, I posted something. Because I saw that they posted a copy of the petition. Although the people that are fighting with her right now, they don't understand what is going on. I will always say, and I will continue to repeat myself, that... If you get yourself involved in between me and that worry, you are going to be injured in the process because you don't know what they go on. So it's better for you to step aside and watch the drama while it lasts. Or you will tell her in all honesty to be truthful to her gullible followers. When she is truthful to her gullible followers, maybe she will find the peace from God that she wants. Because the reason why she come out at every given time and scream and shout, she is the only person that knows the reason. I don't have, I don't know the reason to that. I don't know why she's doing that. Maybe she's been tormented by something. Queen Berry, I will block you if you don't want to listen. You have to listen. This petition was written 2020 in this same very house on this table that I am sitting on right now. By five o'clock in the evening on the twenty-first of on the twenty-third of August, twenty twenty. So let's go to the reason why this petition was written. According to them, what did you 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 know is make us on live video? They were saying that I never be presenter that time. How many years am I on live video? I'm three years on live video. Did you know when this petition was written? This petition was written the same week I celebrated the birthday that Ivier Rio came to my house. Princess Ivier Rio. Wish the birthday was done. 2020 August. When I celebrated 40 years birthday. Ivier Rio was here in this house. I am asking you people that are in the public right now. Was I a presenter when Ivier Rio came to my house? So, uh, Isio Luku, I also advise you to bring out the date you receive that petition in your inbox. Since you say, I wasn't a presenter when the petition was written. And why was the petition written when I was not a presenter? So bring out the date. I hope you have the date in your inbox that you received the petition. Because if you have the date, any of you who, have, who received this petition... You can send it and be posting it online with the date that you receive it. With the date that you receive it. Was this petition written for no reason? 
No. The petition was written because Atuari was fighting me on live video. When I talked with her inside this house, there was an audio which was forced to exchange ways. My platform, which was called Inside Life, I think I was just two, three months on Rita Yemimo TV. Rita Yemimo TV was opened in June. I started doing it in June 2020, and this petition was written around August. I will block you. I will continue to block you if you don't want to listen. Are you crazy? So, this petition was written August, June. I started, please let me be blocking these people. Of your day, when me and this get a talk for inside this house, I was already a presenter on live video one full year on a do cyberspace. Even that time, I don't enter her high. She don't see me, but she was already doing underground work for me. This time when I did talk so, she has already communicated with Ivierio concerning me. Ivierio came to my house during this period for a birthday celebration. Princess, I'm talking about Princess Ivia Rio now. That time where Roko Baroko situation of shoe came out. That same week, that is when this petition was written. So if you have this petition, prove it with it. Precious Meg, that I always complain about, she still there inside this matter where we did talk so. She has been a genesis of the fight where actually they follow me fights. For this live video and the matter go consign joy or dear say wishes she was a head of my group when i the lead for a relationship platform precious meg know it actually know it i was already entering their eye they were already planning because those days anytime they see new presenter away come live video they are already planning an underground attack on how to fall the person, on how to fight the person, on how to bully the person and take the person inside. Precious men is away. This George yesterday was always talking on my platform those days, every time. They knew about it. If I'm online, 1,000 people will be watching when I'm doing my hookup. Atuari was fighting against my hookup and she was using her sister who is in Austria. To fight against my hookup show all of them but they were hiding and doing it just the same manipulation with them they do so that is how they were doing it they never come out with their manipulations are you people hearing me this petition immediately me and not worry talk for inside house here what happened the next day she came out on live video i think that same evening she brought the audios with me and she did talk for inside house Atuari Ekiakbolo is the first person that took me to a live video to disgrace, to insult, to fight because I was not having a platform of bully. I was running a relationship platform. She was expecting me to come and return the fight with her online so that she can start to destroy my platform. She took the audios with me and she did talk. She take it and she carry and go her platform online. She go the play. They analyze them. They fight her. Who be this Rita? She added a person that is supporting me, Lady George, I say, into the fight. And she was fighting two of us online. And she was playing our audio. If I lie against you, Ladiano do tie boy. Because no way. And I continue to repeat. It's only when you are able to say the truth and you apologize. I don't even need to apologize. This juncture apology is not needed. Because you people, you continue to do more evil on top of evil. You continue to increase evil on top of evil. Thinking because you are Agbero squad or gang, you can oppress a person like Rita. You don't know, say, Rita is never, even if you gang up the whole world, you cannot oppress Rita. The only way you can get Rita off your neck is when you are able to say the truth the way it is. Please, Daddy, help me to be blocking these people who don't want to stay on this show. You will say the truth the way we be finished. And you stop fighting for no reason. No other way. 
Continue fighting me. You are fighting the hair. You will never win. You are wasting your time. You know why? Because inside you, you know the truth. You are trying to stay strong for the people that are listening to you and watching you. Will you swear with the head of everything that you have in this life that you are not aware of this petition before today? Are you going to swear that you didn't hear it from the court in their hand? And are you going to also swear that you are not aware of this petition? You know here, petition will go around 4,000 people. How is it supposed to be a secret? If 4,000 people are to put a, a signature on book, so it's going to be secret? No way. The people that live in the same city with me, Many of them were even following you those days. They all received a copy of this petition. And thousands of people signed this petition before you went to court. Why did it happen? I was not having a platform of bullying. When I came on live video, I said something. I said, I hate oppression. I don't like it. And your logo has been oppression right from day one. You enjoy oppressing people. You enjoy oppressing people. You enjoy fighting people. Using your platform and the bullies that you have to do the job. Thinking you are going to win. This petition was written. I sent it out to different people. You are not a Jebo or whatever your name. You are not the only person that received the petition. You are not enough to make a petition go to court and come back. The petition was signed by 4,000 people. Open your link and see how many people signed that petition. Only one person does not sign petition. Do you know what is petition? And why did the link even come to you? It came to you because you are one of the people that already fought online. And you are one of the people that was crying and also seeking justice on how to get that worry off your neck and the neck of your family. As she the ituna, as she the ituna, she the ituna, she the ituna, they go online. That's the same thing she did to me. But she don't want to be truthful to herself anymore. She has always been covering this truth to say, no, be me carry it a video, go online, go play. Most of you are not aware of this, but she knows it. Even many people are aware. After I took the video that I did, we do, all the way we take talk to ourselves, for said, not be everybody they like her. May you carry them, go live video, go the beat for live video. Everybody yeah, like it. You don't do something with person for his eyes. Why do you take them outside before you believe? Because you believe you have a platform that you can use to oppress them to stupor, to shut up. It's not possible. Not everybody will take that nonsense from you. Not everyone. You fought me online. And I also did what I have to do to fight you inside. And this is the petition. I was already a presenter and I don't enter your eye that time. You already finding ways, looking for how you are going to form me. I'm asking you a question. A petition that was written 2020. August 2020. Was I not a presenter already? When the VRIO came to my house, and I'm not using a laugh and say he fought for my step. If yes, you come, broko baruko. So was I not a presenter that time? So why did you say she wasn't a presenter? She don't day inside house. She don't day inside house. She did look for. When I was not a presenter, I don't know whether you exist. I don't have time to listen, watch, or even think about a person like you. I don't watch you. I don't listen to you. The first time I ever say I want to sit down to listen to you is what you, when you was fighting with Bobby and father online. Finish. I don't have time to sit down and listen to market women that don't make senses. So this petition is two years. And I've been presenter since three years. You fought me on social media. And you always decide anytime you come out, you want to come and play the innocent thing. And the person that is also aware of this petition because of what you did to our family will be here on this platform this morning to also talk about it. To clarify it. What petition is and the reason for petition. Was your character then and even now? Is it a cyberbullying character that you have? You have a, the biggest cyberbullying character on the cyberspace. You drag people who don't drag you. You fight people who don't fight you. You make them to go out of their way in looking for solutions on how to get you off their neck. And you cry that they do evil to you. Are you crazy? Do you know the meaning of evil? Do you understand the meaning of evil? If you have a platform of thousands, of hundred thousand, to oppress a person, 
When you put me online and be talking about me on your live video, and 2,000 people were watching and throwing insults on me and my family, and people calling and giving information they know and they don't know about me, I don't the entire your eye. You say, but wait, Mona, wait, may she grow. If she don't grow on this live video, she will meet me. You think I'm a fearless person like, I'm a fearful person like all these other people, all these poor people they carry put under you. It never even reached two years. It's almost two years. A year, eight months. I be like all these people where you put under you, where you take they do yaga yaga. I'm not like them. Me, I be Rita. The petition was written in this house here with my husband when I was busy crying and shedding tears inside my house as you bully me on live video. And if you must know, the petition is already in the hag court. The reason why it was paused is because you let UK. I don't even know whether you know about it. Maybe you know. Who is this? Get out of my platform. Are you crazy? Why should I shut up? Are you mad? Okay. No, you not define explanation. You are saying the explanation. You are saying shut up. To what? So, listen to me very well. When you sit on your platform, your mind doesn't tell you anything about wickedness. The only thing your mind tells you about is that I'm going to make views. I'm going to make my money. I'm going to talk. People are going to listen to me. I make views and I make my money. You never think about what you do to people. You never think about the reputation that you bring down. You never think about the tears you cause families. You never think about the injury you give them in the heart. You never think about the damage you did to their reputation. You never think about all these things. To you, these things doesn't matter. The only thing that matters to you is, let me make the view. Let me make the money. Let me enter my house and let me go and sleep. Let me buy fine clothes. Let me buy fine house. Let me go and buy moto. You are one of the most unreasonable person I've ever, I've ever seen in my life. Very unreasonable. That is why I call you a baby. Even if you are seven years on live video, I see you as a baby because you never take a second thought when you are doing things to people. You normally say you have learned a lesson, but today, ignorance is still full in your character. You have not even learned anything. You have not started. You have not started. And you continue the evil and the conspiracy. And when people want to get you off their neck, they will do and go to whatever extent and limit they will go for. That is why I made that post. And I shared the post online. Instead of you to learn, you will keep proving to say, I'll be boss. Now me.